and according to the legends that were made up. Actually, he was a fertility god. And that bad, big hump on him was his seed. And the other thing that uh, he had, that was which the women liked about him, you know, was, uh, and we, the last ceremony that we had <clears throat> was probably about the, about the mid-70s. I had an uncle that was belonged to that order, the Coco Pali order. And it's held during this time of the year, in the summer. And they actually have the rain dance ceremony and uh, women, because women cannot be initiated in the kachina, so the men dress up like women. And they'll have about, oh, at least 30, 30, uh, you know, those matatis with the grinding stone, yeah. Yeah. the original ones. And they'll set it up in the plaza. And then the Kachina dancers will be standing around like this, and in the front of them will be the flute players. And the Kachina are the flute players. And they got different flutes, you know, depending on the, and some of them are about a long, and because they're, they're as the song is going, they the play, the, and that rhythm, that's, that's to do that yeah. grinding. And then when they have that, you know, in there, they'll go like this, and they're sitting on there, and they're grinding corn. Uh, uh, yeah, grinding corn, and then and they all have piles of it, you know. The, and then the mudhead clowns are the ones that are going over there and putting it into these big piles of corn, different grades, and then fine, fine. Just like if you go over there into the grocery store and buy a, a bag of flour, remember, yeah. it's it's that fine, but they use different grades of that the stone. So that was a ceremony that is no longer uh, done because we substituted uh, television mm -hmm. for that type of ceremonies. We substituted um, alcohol for that and it's hard work. But I'm, I'm glad I saw that when I was still a kid. And then in the end is when Coco Pelli comes in. I mean, he's got a penis made out of a gourd. Uh, the other day, I said, oh, you know, my hours is bigger than your real you know, that. You know, each key, but it ever means dream, okay. So what, my uncle was one of them. So what they did, in the old days, they had a big uh, was a reservoir that covered all his back. So I don't know how many gallons is in there. That's a huge one. It's, it's like a big bladder in there. Then you got a little valve in there. So, so it goes, it goes, so, I mean, this is not, this is ritual. Yeah, yeah. This is culture, this is religion, this is spirituality for the, uh, for fertility of the crops. And uh, today, kids might probably laugh at it. In the old days, you know, it was all part of religion, spirituality. But we used to, we used to, kids are kids everywhere in the world, you know, you would just make fun of it. Things, <laughs> we get whacked on the head, you know, <laughs> grandma would come on. <laughs> but these are the ceremonies that after a while we didn't allow anybody to, to come in and participate, even to this day.